فمن يعمل مثقال ذرة and so then whoever may have done the equivalent in weight مثقال in Arabic is the equivalent of the weight of something like this is مثقال of that means this one weighs as much as that when you compare two things that's مثقال okay مثقال is a, is a unit of measure like you can say nowadays a gram or a milligram or a kilogram or a pound those are all مثقال actually in old Arabic a means by which weight is measured a standard by which weight is measured so Allah says whoever may have done the worth of a dharra the weight, I won't translate dharra yet, of good, will see it. If you have done, if you've, and ya'mal actually means consciously done. Amal includes niya in it, fi'il doesn't. Whoever consciously did an act of good, and meant to do something good, even if it's the worth of what Allah calls a dharra. Now what is dharra? A dharr ma yura fi shu'a'i shams min al haba. Dharr is if you're sitting by a window on a sunny day, and you see little fibers of dust flying around, one of those is called a dharr. And what does that weigh? Allah says the equivalent of the weight of that of a good deed, a human being will see. That is almost impossible to see to begin with. Forget weigh, forget value. In other words, human beings will be shocked on that day that Allah counted the good deeds that they never even thought about. It didn't even occur to them that that was a good deed. And Allah will have counted it. And they will see it. This is the second time in the surah you're talking about the shock of the human being. The first shock of the human being was when the earth was shaking up and the human being was saying, what is wrong with this? What's going on with the earth? Malaha. The second time the human being is shocked is when he sees or she sees a speck, like a flying bit of dust. And by the way, where does dust come from? The earth, it rises from the earth. So you saw in the beginning of the surah, the earth is giving up its heavy burdens. And now by the end, not only are the heavy burdens a means of consequence, by the end of it, every speck is of consequence. And that's why the two times the word thiqal was used, athqal was for the heavy loads of the earth, you know, in, in, in the beginning, وَأَخْرَجَتِ الْأَرْضُ أَثْقَالَهَا And now the same root origin again, فَمَنْ يَعْمَلْ مِثْقَالَ ذَرَّةٍ خَيْرًا يَرَهُ And it's, it's a mercy from Allah Azza wa Jal. When we think of the Judgment Day, we think of our bad deeds first. And in the surah, everything is so scary, but by the time he gets to the end, he says, before I tell you about your bad deeds, let me tell you first, none of your good deeds are going to be wasted away. There's not a good deed that will not go on record. It will be counted and it will be measured. Even if it's so small that it was impossible to measure in this world. Now here, herein lies the question, how is something impossible to measure in this world, but is so valuable on Judgment Day, or of any value on Judgment Day? You see, the thing is, when the Prophet ﷺ says, إِنَّمَا الْعَمَالُ بِالنِّيَاتِ Actions are entirely dependent on their intentions. That is not how the world works. That is only how Islam works. That's not how the real world, or this, this worldly life, that's not how it works. If somebody does a great job, or does everything they needed to market the product, to sell the product, and they made no sales. They made no sales. Are they gonna keep their job or are they gonna lose their job? They're gonna lose their job. You didn't get the results. And they go to their boss and say, you know, إِنَّمَا الْأَعْمَالُ بِالنِّيَاتِ Actions are based, I mean, I intended to make the sales. And وَإِنَّمَا لِكُلِّ مْرِئِمْ مَا نَوَى Every person should get rewarded according to their intention. My intention was to make more sales than have ever been made in history. Yes, I didn't make a single sale, but since I should be rewarded based on my intentions, I need a bonus. That is not how the world works. The world works on results. What impact did you have? How much sales did you make? How many audience did you have? How many people attended the program? How much money did you raise? How many people did you feed? Like a charitable organization, its success is going to be some bar graphs. What you can measure. What you can see. But somebody living in some apartment somewhere and he's helping their neighbor out or whatever, that's not on a chart anywhere. You understand? The same way, there's a fundraiser and they say, who's gonna give 50,000? And nobody raises their hand because it's awkward. But some guy writes a check for 50,000. And by the end of it, somebody, when the fundraiser is like already over, people are dying, they're falling off in their chairs, and the guy's not letting go, and he says, okay, who's gonna give $5? Right? And when somebody says five dollars, the takbir is much lower. <laughs> like, it's not like takbir! It's not like that anymore. I was like, eh, eh, eh. You know, like that. 
But what do you know that there's someone in the audience who only had five dollars and fifty cents, and they gave five dollars? You don't know that. In this world, it only added to the balance by five dollars. But in the next world, that five dollars may be worth way more than anybody in this world could ever have imagined. The scales of that day are different because they are based on the level of sacrifice you made, the level of difficulty you went through, the level of difficulty I had to go through. So that day, it may be that the 50,000 was worth nothing or worth less than the 50 cents on the other side or the quarter on the other side. It may be that case. So this is mithqala darratin. What you thought was nothing. Nobody else thought it was significant. Your contribution, who would even know? Who would even care? Today, for example, we think about, the, like think of our, uh, the scholars that have passed this deen along to us, right? And those scholars that passed this deen along, many of them, we don't know much about their mothers. We don't know much about their fathers. We don't know much about their influences. And the, the love that their mother showed them, who we may not even know, may be the reason they became who they are. But nobody give credit to the mom. Nobody knows much details about the mom, unless he talked about his mom or wrote something about her. We don't know. But that woman who the world doesn't know, and her son or her daughter, everybody knows. That woman is reaping so much from the ummah because of what she did. You understand? There are people on the scene and there are people behind the scenes. There are people that are prominent and people that are invisible. On the Day of Judgment, you'll see that this, this is why Allah calls it like a lahwun wa la'ib. It's like a game and a play. And even the idea of la'ib, some say is playing along. Like somebody looks like a king, somebody looks like a beggar, but on Judgment Day, the beggar looks like a king and the king looks like a beggar. Things are gonna flip. So whoever had, may have done even the worth of a flying piece of dirt, a speck flying in the air, something weightless in this world, even the worth of that, they will see. And the other implication of that, of course, is even if in the spiritual sense it was worth so little, like we prayed but our mind was somewhere else, we made mistakes in our prayer, our wudu was faulty or whatever else, it was some like 99% the salah was horrible. That 1% of good that was in it, Allah will count that too. He'll give that to you, you know. This is why at the end of our prayer we say, رَبَّنَا تَقَبَّلْ مِنَّا Master, accept from us. Okay, it was broken, it was flawed, it was a lot of problems in it, but whatever ha patch job we gave you, just take it from us. You know, you you'll accept it from us. That's the dua of Ibrahim salam passed on to us. And for us, it's a lot more valid, you know, because he, he built the Kaaba and made that dua. We do what we do, and then we make that dua, Allah accept from us, you know. So this is what, فَمَنْ يَعْمَلْ مِثْقَالَ ذَرَّةٍ خَيْرًا يَا 